Hi, I'm Shelly Lavette with ChildCareLand.com, and today I want to show you how to make a tissue paper wreath. This is really excellent for developing fine motor skills for children, and it's a lot of fun for them to do, and it's easy to set up. All you need to have is tissue paper cut into squares or torn into squares, and depending upon the children that you work with, they can do that themselves, or for younger children, you can have, you can have a bowl sitting out with some large squares of tissue paper already in there and because we're so close to Christmas I've chosen to use red and green but you can certainly use whatever colors that you want to use. You also need to have a paper plate, just a regular paper plate, some glue, scissors, a hole punch and either yarn or ribbon to attach to the wreath to make it hang. I, we like to use glitter make things sparkly so this is always optional. You can use glitter or gold glitter glue to decorate the, the wreath once you're done. And what would you, you would do is you would start out with your paper plate and you would want to cut out the center of the paper plate. You can, you can see there's already a, kind of like a, a circle here already. So that's the part you want to cut out of your paper plate. And you want to be careful when you're punching that hole through. I'm just taking my scissors and working them back and forth to get that started and then work your way over to the edge and you start cutting out the circle in the middle. It does not have to be perfect at all just to have an opening for the wreath part and depending again again depending upon the ages of the children that you work with this may be something that you want to pre-start for uh, children and they can maybe finish the circle on the inside themselves or you can have these already cut out and sitting out um, for each child to have one clean that edge up a little bit right there Oops, there we go all right, so we have the paper plate with the center removed in it already. The next step would be to apply glue, and you can do this, or the children can do this themselves. Um, they can either do dots on the paper plate, or just squiggle lines, or go just all the way around. But you want to make sure you have enough glue for the tissue paper um, for that to stay on to. See, so we have all of our glue on the paper plate. Next step, and this is a fine motor skills part right here is the tissue paper. The children would take a piece of tissue paper, scrunch it with their fingers, and just press it in to the glue. And they would go all the way around the paper plate. And you know, they can make whatever color pattern they want to do it. It doesn't have to be red or green, red, green. Just whatever they want to do is fine. But this is fun for them. They love the feeling of the paper and the sound that it makes. And uh, depending in, upon the age of the children, again, once they've gone around once, some children like to go back and fill in where they have like white spaces just to make it more full. But you certainly don't have to do that, especially with the younger ones. Going around once maybe all that they can do. And once that's done, I'm not going to go all around here for time purposes, but you can kind of get the general idea that you just go all the way around your paper plate. And once that's done, if you want, you can um, put Gold glitter, do drop, gold glitter glue, excuse me, drops around on the paper plate. And then you would punch a hole in the top of your paper plate. I already have one finished here. You would punch a hole and then you would just, uh, right here's the hole, and then you would attach yarn or ribbon. And it looks really pretty hanging in your classroom and it's wonderful to send home as a Christmas decoration for the children too. I don't know if you can see any sparkles on there, but. Um, Again, it's a fun project, easy to set up, and wonderful for developing fine motor skills. For a tissue paper wreath, I'm Shelly Levette with ChildCareLand.com. And thanks for watching.